a guy who's been missing in an action for quite a while is on the way next but we need to have our morning conversation now this one we must discuss there is something brewing in the corridors of justice and it um, let me just give you the story a court has ordered 72 year old Jim Nambaru to undergo a DNA test to prove mater paternity of a four year old child he allegedly sired with a 24 year old lady. The lady sued the billionaire businessman seeking 4.4 million shillings per year in child support. This is what she wants in monthly expenses. She's asking for 50,000 shillings for food, 50,000 shillings a month for medical expenses, 50,000 shillings a month for clothes, 100,000 shillings a month for shopping, and she also needs six. 600,000 shillings for the kids' school fees per term. Unajua hii mwaka tulisema hapa ni kuambiana ukweli. Even if it's your friend, we are going to talk the truth. He is a very good friend of mine. Yes, tutakuwa tunaeka kila kitu hapa tunapasua. But today I'm on his side. Why are you on his side? We've been talking about uh, boy shout. Sasa we need to talk about golden men. Let me ask you, what is unfair with what she asked for? First of all, that girl is old. 24. How old is Jimna? 72. Na woni kitu woni woni wewe woni woni kesho chochote you are not seeing a problem with the age gap eh. see you people keep saying that uh, you mm. you're very okay no no woni woni vi kitu woni kimchezo imechezwa mali woni woni mchezo gani woni woni you know this is not the first case we are dealing with eh tuko na hizi case mingi sana is only that they are settled out of court and by the time a part a court court order aende apime huyo mtoto wako of 4 years hai yes let me ask you a question because ah, Molimu thinks Molimu thinks that this me. lady is a gold digger. Ah, we are trying to find another name. But it's an uncle a time. Huh? So let me ask you a question. How huh? much how much should she ask for, for food per month? Wachana hata na kuuliza no. wewe uoni from the word go makosa mali litokea from wewe uoni ile mbotego mali lingila Hiyo ni mtego? Of course, of course. Let me what, tell you something. First you call, of all, you call that? Jim Nambaro is a billionaire. A multi-billionaire. Yeah, so you want no, him, no, so hold on, hold on. So no. you want you want him to be giving her 5,000 for food. Is that what you want? Una, even your opening statement is already has given you out because already, already there's a motive. We so, cannot open a sentence by Usema is a multi-billion. Meaning, ni nini hii alijua akifanya Who took him? let me ask you let me ask you kwa nini nani alitoa jim na zuruali hapana wewe no. eh hey, hey. wanaume alilazimishwa nikivia je wanaume so, anaweza kuwa is... kuteleza na tulicheza hiyo wimbo wa kuteleza the thing is you need to see where this girl is also coming from ndio aseme anataka hii pesa yote pa month now, now you are she's a billionaire of yours hard yes he's a billionaire if, if i was hard be asking for double this he can afford it if it's his child, Aki he'll pay. Hey, you want her to ask for 5,000, so you're happy. Or 2,000. And school fees, I teach 6,000. That's what you want to hear. What yeah, you, what to give you, here. you see, the problem with you, you don't want to discuss the strategy that this girl applied. And that is what is happening in this Nairobi. He's a billionaire. He laid down with her. They had a child. Her child will grow up like a child of a billionaire. Oh, yes, believe that. Take that to the bank. Take that to the bank. Is she asking for too much? At 72. Is she asking for too much? At 72 years. Sasa so mnarudisha. So let me ask you a question. Hmm? What was he doing with her? It's not eh? about what. No, no, no. It's about that. 
They lay on the same bed, they excited a baby, that child will grow up as the child of a billionaire. With the kind of lifestyle a child of a billionaire enjoys when they are growing up. But do you know mutu akitaka kukutrap, eh? They can, they can... Ah, don't we are give me very, that nonsense. We are what, very weak what, li- Listen, if, very listen, there's no trap here. And you, if you don't, don't want to address that if, issue. If you don't it want... It is becoming so difficult if, even to discuss this. If, if you do not want to get a child, then wrap it up before you smack it up, Okay? Ladies, you've got a baby with a billionaire. So you're supposed to ask for 2,000 shillings a month. And 11,000 for rent a month. Eh. You are not seeing who advised hey. her. You cannot hey. see the strategy and the agenda. You don't want to see that site. See Jamali, it was Ruali. Let's talk. The lady has sued the billionaire seeking 4.4 million shillings per year for child support. She's seeking, amongst other expenses, 50,000 shillings a month for food, 50,000 shillings a month for medical expenses, 50,000 shillings a month for clothes, and 100,000 shillings a month for shopping. She also needs 600,000 shillings for the child school fees per term. Kuna kitu ujeka hapo? Na nini? Nyumba. Nyumba hata wajataja hapa. Nyumba anataka nuliwe nyumba. Ya 45 million. Minimum. He's got a lot of money. He's my friend. Mimi is stuck with you because this is not the first case. Ata na Juliza, age wise, can a rope really shoot? I don't want to go to that. Uh, shoot pool. Eh? Yeah. Yeah. If it's his child, oh, he's going to pay this and so much more. I can guarantee you. Na you, coach, do, coach, you, 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 do, you do not go dropping your seed everywhere. And exp- who do you think will raise those children? And they shall be raised to the standards of which their father is uh, living his life. Koti mesema ende apfanya DNA? Yes. Eh? Yes. Apele kuna daktari wa serikali. If it is his child, Aki, that child will grow up like a child of a billionaire. And that child deserves it. Hey, na maina unafuraya ga hizi vitu. Si kufuraya? You cannot say ni mtego, yet you're the one who put yourself onto that bed. No one forced you. At um, that, it was done at gunpoint. At that age. <laughs> Miriam Ruto from Bayate, good morning, saying men should understand that money is everything nowadays. The moment you fall in love, be ready for anything to happen. Stop complaining. Mtoto ni wako, tafta pesa nani? Kuna kitu inaitua premeditated. If it is his child, he will pay. Unaplanea mutu. Huh? Charles Miner is saying 95% of cases involving ladies taking men to court seeking for child support involves wealthy or rich men. You will wait forever for a lady to take a toilet or a digger to court seeking child support. Ladies, let all men be equal. If no one held you at gunpoint when you're removing your trousers and your underwears, imagine you're going to pay. And I think she asked for too little. He's a billionaire multi-billionaire she should ask for more she should ask for more she's asked for very little governor kahu said mena do you know you cannot uh, impregnate a lady if she's not willing to have a child with you yes. that child slept to that man deliberately yes 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 and you know she was around 20. she was yeah, she, 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 she was 20, 20 because the child is four now she was very fertile. Akajua hapa. Huh? Well, no, no, your strategy. Akajua. Huh? What strategy was this? And why do men always say this? Who took her to that? Who took him to that lady? Hello? Maina? Yes. Sikia, sikia, wana. Ebu zalimia kingangi hapo. Ame zalimika? Uh-huh. Hii, hii, maneno hii, kwa hii, Nairobi, hiko mingi. Hold on, what is kuwekelewa mtoto? Ebu dis- ah, pana, explain, pana, no. Pana, pana, maina, no, pana, explain, pana. what do you mean kuwekelewa mtoto? Ah, pana, si pana, wema ulingi, pana. si ulingia kwa hiyo kitana na hiyo mstana. Ah, Ebu di kuulize. Pana, pana, pana. Uli kum... mtego, na, na mkingangi ya naelewa hii maneno wendi utaki kuelewa. Aoni hiyo mtego, anajifanya aoni? Anajifanya aoni. Wewe ukiwekewa chakula kwa meza? Na kuuliza 
hata kama huna njaa uh, uh, utakula hmm. utakula ok ukikula ukikula then you deal with the consequences ala wana kukula hey. ni kushiba sasa kushiba hiyo maneno ingini sasa haukua unakula u hey. maneno ingini toke okay? hey. ulikuwa unakula hey. ili ulikuwa unakula ushibe sasa ukianza kuniambia tena sijui unatapika sijui watu watu nini nini na chakula tulikula sisi mzuri pamoja eh hey, pamoja <laughs> eh hey. wewe unakula nga chakula ufaya nini maina ushibe yes so <laughs> wajeni kutuambia sasa mkiekelea chakula kwa meza yetu iko story ingini pata ya pana kila mtu wajibange pana aya he eh? niko na wea soja <laughs> kabisa eh, 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 my, my friend uchakula ikiegelewa kwa meza mwatu wa kule na kila mtu wejipange bas eh? bas yes ok thank yes. you please explain one phrase that men use a lot to me hmm. niliwekelewa mtoto please explain that phrase to me how do you mean niliwekelewa mtoto cause now everybody saying jim na aliwekelewa mtoto seriously because what is it <laughs> in fact guys i don't even want to hear from you i want to hear from the ladies is she asking for too much this lady hii ni mtego mtego ina gani what is kuwekelewa mtoto that's what i'm trying to figure out because the previous caller said that ati anawekelewa mtoto so what happened how did you end up in that bed if i may ask you hmm you, you how did you end up in that bed treating as you saying in fact the girl should ask for more koni the man did not know the consequences of going to bed with the lady aliwekelewa when he was going there what did he think would come out of flat screen tv no oyo Charles men are saying things women do didn't she know mbaro is married you know Charles it takes two to tango eh and if you do not want a baby gentlemen especially out there like i said wrap it up before you smack it up tafadhali Patrick Rudiger you asking as a lady why don't you prevent the pregnancy as a man why don't you just prevent it yourself hii nawe <laughs> David Gate is saying you would advise the lady to just take care of the kid by her on her own who when that child has got a billionaire father in a my anyway he what is kuwekelewa mtoto because me that's where i'm still stuck there by the way I am still stuck there. Hello. Good morning, Maina. Good morning. Hi, you're speaking to Sylvia Masiki Bes. Yes, Sylvia, how are you? I'm very fine, sir. Salimi mwalimu. Na msalimika. I'm very mad at this point ya kuwekelewa first of all. Eh. Unawekelewa unawekelea nini? Eh. Si wewe mwenyewe uko unawekelea kafu kafu. Si ndio? Yes. First of all, yeah. how can you deny your bloodline? Bas. Chuali, alafu sasa hii mtoto akiwa maskini, yake ni mtoto akiwa maskini umtambui. Kesho ukisikia ndo president fulani, unamtafuta. Wewe na hiyo kinyangalika yako, unakuja kusimama tisti tisti hapo at this is my son, this is my whatever. U, u, watu wachunge vitu zao. Bas. Yes, they should take care of their kids. I'm very mad at that thing at kuweka. Mimi Oh. Okay. Ah ah. All right, thank you very much. Hello. Mai na waka gani? Good morning. Good morning, brother. Yes. Salimia kingani hapo? Aha, msalimika. No, kingani? Yes. Eh, mai na before anything else. Kind of with all due respect, eh? Eh. Eh uh, today is my lady's uh, birthday. Okay. Kayamba kwake tafadhali. Haya sawa. Now. Mm. Uh, there's nothing like trapping. Yes. 
the world that you're living today yeah it is about option uh, the information and everything that we know about pregnancies nakila kitu diseases hakuna mtu unaweza sema it was being trapped yeah this is something that someone has enjoyed yeah they have been together yes and they have been having it for a number of times so this is not the first time yes and for the lady to decide to have that kwelever eh nive nyo amepelekana yeah so let no one give any issues about being trapped here yeah it is two things the wallet yeah at the zip yes in the zip even because you may find a gazi bus so there's nothing here that we are supposed to discuss beyond that asante <laughs> and happy birthday to your lady once again that's all thank that's all. you hello good morning good morning <laughs> at 72 and 20 what and 24 well done yeah and it's a sort of cut sort of skin tight aki as a potelea in the folds of his wrinkles ah uh, guy i said guy 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 what let's talk about access yes for this young girl to access this old man this man must have gone through so much yeah in, uh, in you know to, to make sure that they have their privacy yeah yes i mean they don't go to this to lodges where you're not so much that's it true yes they must go to somewhere exclusive so he has time so that as uh Kingani said this uh rope can shoot pull yes yeah so i mean let's not blame at the girl hey. he, said her. he wanted to feel you know like i said yeah inside. exactly Yo yo, so Alipe. Alipe. Al Alipe. Alipe, tena proper gay. Wao mtoto wako na bahati. Ah, kinakuambia. Sikunjama dream. Thank you very Ole. much. Asante sana. Alipe. No one how she's becoming a role model. Alipe, kwani Maina, luckily for you, haukuangi mkora. Sasa hii ungekuu na lea watoto wenye ambaye zi wako. After God fear women, young guy. Miriam Ruto, my darling, is saying men should stop complaining over their blessings. Do you know what kind of blessings we, their children are? Hmm. Esther Biruk is saying, how do you sleep with your granddaughter? Ata nguvu za kuvua nguo unatoa wa pishuali. Funga hii kitu baina. Wacha tufunge. Hello. Hello Maina. Good morning. Good morning. Yes. Aki sisi tumeamua tutakufungia whisky hautakuwa na kunywa whisky tena wewe. Kwa nini? You can never be this wrong. How am I wrong? Kuna kitu nito breach of contract. Eh. Wakati niko na wewe, eh. kuna ile maelewano because I believe that lady was a uh, beautifully shughulikiwed when it comes to kushughulikiwa mariki kimfuko. Eh. eh. So it's a fika mahali aka breach contract the contract was you are going to have fun that's it no we ushikilia pande yako deal na mini ushikilia pande yangu hii mpaka saa tuwanza kutengeza kitu kwa nda yeah. note zi ambazo takuja kukwe invented yeah. kwa sababu there is no way kutakuwa tumekubalia na wei kitu flani alafu ukujo tumje back door kunifikia tena umelifanya project na wewe maina ukweli unajua hii ukweli yote hafo wambia wachana kwanza kale nimesikia hako kalipika hako mbele hmm eh. maina kwa, kwa, kwa hii wiki tafadhali kuwa saidia tu kidogo uangalia from man's perspective kasa hii yule nimesote hivya kuna mchana anayata kuja hapa kusema huu oh, ewe ndo baba mtoto huu oh, tire lakini wacha nipate kakitu eh hata kuja kuniambia mimi baba mtoto wakitafuta mtoto wapidi garona siya naigiri italipa kulipa but if I don't have, they have got no issue with me. Natembea free hapa, ata chifo yezi niambea habari. Hakuna mtu anitafuta until nipata kakitu. So, sa hizi breach of contract, hiyo tutangalia kisheria. Na tukotu na sign NDA. Aki non-disclosure agreement. Wewe kama tulikuwa na hiyo, hiyo likuwa shidetu. Kikikumania kaguka. 